Here you go, baby. Take your vitamin. Well, good morning, guys. Today is July 12th, and I just got back from Mexico yesterday. I am going to try to vlog today. <laughs> Y'all know how this goes with me, but I promise I will try my best. But yeah, we just got back from Mexico yesterday. And um, if you follow me on Instagram, you probably saw like on some of my stories. And I'm also planning to make a reel with just like photos and clips of the trip. I haven't done it yet, but by the time you guys see this video, it's probably up. So, check out my Instagram. Right now, I'm just making breakfast. I have my coffee. I'm making me some eggs. My daughter already... I should normally get something before me. But I gave her some yogurt and milk. And she loves these um, Belvita crackers. Especially the cinnamon. So, I gave her something already. And now, it's mom's turn. But, y'all... Like I said, I just got back from vacation yesterday. So today, I'm really aiming to be a productive day. I want to unpack because, y'all, I'm the type of person that will come back from a trip, even if it was literally like a two-night stay, and I'll leave my, my luggage or my bag packed for two months. So I really want to get better at that. Maybe I'll go for a walk. And... I want to do some budgeting, y'all. Um, before we left on our trip, I ordered a little budget calendar thing on Amazon. So, I'm going to try to start budgeting a little bit more than what I have been. But I'm going to take some time today to just, like, look through my finances, which is super important after you, you know, have a trip. <sighs> Anyways, let me finish my eggs and... I'm gonna try with you guys a little bit more while I eat. All right, y'all, so I have my eggs here and this is a leftover croissant from my salad that I had last night. And I had my coffee, y'all. I have not had coffee pretty much the whole time I was on vacation because I really didn't like the coffee at the resort. It was like, My daughter is shaking the table, so the camera is doing that. What are you trying to do? What are you doing? Mama, what are you trying to do? All right, so yeah. I didn't really like the coffee on the resort. I don't know how to explain it. It was just too like soft. Like, I don't know. I was missing the coffee flavor. So I I need my coffee. But anyways, y'all, I know I haven't posted in some months. My daughter's trying to sabotage me. So this is editing Brie again. And I just want to say, I am not mad at my daughter. Like. She was like getting in and out of the chair, so she was shaking the table. But I just wanted to put that in here because I know some of y'all will see one clip and try to write a novel about it, y'all. Like, I was literally laughing when I said that she's trying to sabotage me, so chill. Anyway, I know it's been a long time since I've posted, but I think I made a little update, but y'all, 
at the end of 21, we lost a lot of family members. I had two job changes and the second job kept me very busy. I'm talking, I was working 60 plus hours a week, which is crazy. I used, I used to hear people say that and I'm just like, how are you working 60 plus hours a week? But I really was. Um, I started teaching and I didn't realize it was a job that followed me home. Like when I would come home, I'm bringing home paperwork, have to grade, make lessons. I had parents contact me at eight, nine o'clock at night about their kids. So even on the weekends, you know, if I'm not done with grades or lesson plans, like I still have to work on the weekend. So yeah, but anyways, all those things in combination really just made it hard for me to post. And then this year, I made my intentions video for the first of the year, which I always do. And I found out that YouTube demonetized my channel. And that made me want to post even less, I'm not going to lie. Like, I liked posting, but I'm not going to lie and say, like, yeah, I, I don't want to make money from YouTube. Like, if I can have a, an additional stream of income doing something that's like fun and enjoyable of course i want that and i'm not gonna sit here and lie to y'all i feel like people are like yeah i would do youtube even if, you know if i never ever got paid like girl please you know you want your coin we all do and i want my coin and i worked hard to get to the point of monetization obviously i'm still posting because i'm not monetized now and i wasn't all those other years but it just sucks because it took me some years to get monetized. I was not one of those people that posted one video and blew up and went viral. It took me several years and two different channels. This is not even my first YouTube channel. So it was definitely disheartening to find out that I got demonetized and it made me not want to post as much, honestly, because I basically have to start all over. I have to regain all those watch hours and all that when i already did that before um so that made me not as motivated because what am i doing it for i feel like i took the time to make my videos made my content i edited it edited it uploaded it and those videos are still bringing views to your platform so like who are you to demonetize my channel after i put in the work just because i haven't posted for a few months like to me i didn't think that was fair so I'm not gonna lie, that also disheartened me. But it is what it is. Anyways, I just want to give y'all that little update. These are my vacation nails, by the way. I always do like a neutral nail for vacation because I'm wearing like so much craziness. But they're really cute. And y'all, I got so dark this summer. Woo! But anyways, I'm going to eat because I've been talking this entire vlog. I'm going to go ahead and eat my breakfast, drop my daughter off at daycare, and then kind of get started with the things that I want to do today. So, yeah. All right. So, we are in the car. Can you say hi, baby? Hi, baby. <laughs> um, I'm about to drop Zaya off. And I don't have any meat to go to the gym today, <laughs> but... I'm going to see if I feel like going for a walk around my neighborhood just to get a little bit of exercise in. Um, yeah. And then after my walk, I will get on to my different tasks for today. I think my to-do list is going to be unpack and then look at like my budget and my finances. Yeah. I have to do something for Notice Apparel and then um, my certification. What I wanted to do was actually finish my assignments before we left for vacation, but I didn't finish all of them, but there's one in particular that... Are you singing? I don't know what song that is, but... Y'all, she's been talking so much lately. It's so cute, actually. And she's really smart. I know every mom says their child is so smart, but she really is. Anyways, let me focus on driving. Can you say bye? Bye. 
Alright, so I dropped Zaya off and now I'm just gonna walk for a little bit. I just did not have it in me to go all the way to the gym and like do a serious workout. It's been a couple weeks since I've been. So, yeah. But I do wanna make sure that I get back to just being more active a few times a week. So, I'm gonna start today with a little walk through the neighborhood. Um, I'm just gonna do 30 minutes because it's definitely a little later than normal. Um, I would have normally dropped her off before 930. So I've already lost like a good two hours out of the day just by like having a slow morning. But yeah, I still wanna prioritize exercise and fresh air and health. So I'm gonna do a 30 minute walk and then go back to the house so I can start tackling my to-do list. Yeah. y'all so i'm back from my walk i actually cut it a few minutes short but you know it's a start but anyways i'm about to go ahead and start unpacking my luggage this is the suitcase i brought to cancun and this was my carry-on bag so i'm gonna start just unpacking um Oh y'all, look at this cute bag. I wanted to film a lookbook for my trip of like all the things that I wore, my little outfits, which I mean, I guess I still could do. If you guys want to see me do like a vacation lookbook, just put it in the comment section. I could still film it. Um, like, yeah, I could still film it. it. Just, it'll be like after the fact, but I found this super cute bag on Amazon um i can link it below on my amazon page um but yeah it was super cute and i did wear it it really went like it's super cute for vacation and like certain outfits so this one's cute let me know if y'all want me to do that that lookbook right, so i have pretty much unpacked i just have a few more things to put away um so yeah now i'm going to put away my luggage and one thing I like to do is put like my small little pouches and like duffel bags inside of my big luggage to store it away. And this is the carry-on that I use. I will link it below, it was on Amazon. Um, yeah, it was great for a carry-on and they have the little slip to put your handle from your suitcase. And this is also good for like a weekender bag. They have this pouch at the bottom that you could put like shoes or heavier items. So I liked it. It was really spacious and they also had tons of different like colors and patterns. Done with that, I actually ordered me something because I'm getting hungry. So I ordered some tropical smoothie and some Burger King. So it should be here soon. So I'm going to eat that and yeah. But I can check off unpacking off of my to-do list. Alright, so my order just got here. Um, you guys are on top of my smoothie. I ordered a Bahama Mama from Tropical Smoothie. And then I also ordered a grilled cheese from there. I've never had their food. So hopefully this tastes good. 
I am going to eat my lunch, watch some Netflix, and then I'm going to work on my budgeting. So, yeah. All right, guys. So I moved over to the table, and I'm still drinking my smoothie. Mm. But now I'm going to start working on my budget and looking through my finances. Like I said, I just came from a trip, so it's definitely important to stay on track of your finances and your budget, but especially after a trip or a period of, you know, heavy spending. So that's what I'm about to do right now. I have this budget book. I just got this um, right before I left, actually. It's from Amazon. I feel like this whole video, I've been like, Amazon, 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 Amazon. But anyway, it's from Amazon, so if you're looking for one, I'll link it below. Haven't really used it much. I literally just got it. Um, the first page kind of looks like this. So it just says like your name, phone number, address, email. Um, and then this is the very first thing that's in there. It says financial goals. And then it has like several different goals. It goes up to eight goals. So I wrote down that I want to have my car paid off this year. Um... So yeah, there's other goals that I can add. I just, like I said, I haven't really used it yet. They give you a month view calendar. Um, so I obviously wrote Cancun. Um, and then I marked off like, you know, payday with some stickers. So this is editing Brie. And I literally went on a tangent about like every page in this planner. Um, so I just like cut it off. Um, I'm sure a lot of people will be interested to see what's on every single page and stuff like that. Um, but I just don't want to like fill up the whole vlog with that. So I'm also just starting this book. I might even try a different one and just see like which one I prefer. So if you guys want me to eventually do a separate video where I like go into more detail about whichever budget book I do choose to actually use and like, then I can do that in a different video and actually go into each page and have a dedicated video for that. I just didn't want to put too much of it in the vlog. Okay. I'm just that. going to work on this. I'm going to see what my accounts are looking like and plan out my next check. Um, today is Tuesday. I get paid on Friday. So I'm just going to go ahead and plan out my next check. So. I can check off budget from my to-do list now. So the next two things that I will want to work on today is some stuff for notice apparel, which I needed to do like a month ago, honestly. And then I want to get some work done for my um, certification, but I have to do that on my other computer. This is my work computer. I need to, that stuff is saved on my personal computer. So I'm going to probably take a break from vlogging and I'm going to spend some time doing that. It's really nothing to film. You're just going to watch me stare at a computer. So I'll probably pick back up like later on this evening and get you guys up to date. So. All right, y'all. So it is um, some a few hours later. I am just hanging out in the garage. 
I finished the three assignments that I wanted to do today. The only thing I didn't get to is sending that email for notice apparel. Um, and it's mainly because I have to like sit down, get like the exact measurements and things like that. So that's why it hasn't been easy to really get it done. I'm not just typing up a couple sentences, but to accommodate, I'll just prioritize that on tomorrow's do list and I'll make sure that I send that before I work on my assignments. So, but yeah, I'm just hanging out out here. It actually started to rain, but I'm just hanging out here for a little bit and then I'm going to shower in a few minutes before my daughter gets home. So I don't have to worry about it once she's here and I can just play with her. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. And I might pick up again, like just to show y'all what we're doing when she gets home. Don't break the plane. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, no, You got Cody? Y'all, I almost forgot to close out the vlog. Almost. Um, Zaya came home, she had her snack, and we were like playing with the ball and stuff. And now we're going to bed. She's already in bed. And now I'm going to bed. So I'll see you in my next video. And don't forget to let me know if you guys still want me to do that vacation lookbook because I, I can do it. It'll just be after the facts. Yeah. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up.